of course, if you're going to be a public figure, if you're going to have uh, followers, if you're going to be a person of considerable influence, you're going to be held to a higher standard. You're going to be more accountable. And at least that appears to be what's going on with uh, Mr. Trump. Is uh, They're sticking it to him because of his influence. Uh, he... Uh, he has more, he's more accountable than your average Joe, than your ordinary citizen. Uh, because, uh, so they're going to make an example out of him. Uh, and it's a deterrent against repeated behavior from other people. Uh, you can't have corruption anywhere, especially in government. Uh, there has to be purity and righteousness, and, uh, you know, yeah, you can't let corruption just run haywire. That's why, that's why, uh, that's probably why we're not getting involved directly into the Ukrainian-Russian ordeal, because rumor has it, uh, the Ukrainian government is full of corruption, but so is Russia's government. Uh, in fact, probably most governments are, are, guilty of, are guilty of corruption. So, uh, you know, it's like which evil, which evil do you want to pick? The lesser evil, obviously, the lesser evil. But you know, we certainly don't want to come to the aid of a corrupt government because uh, in our hands would be guilty of, of corruption. Uh, so even, even in a 